What's going on, my beautiful Aquarius? Thank you guys for tuning in to Jacayla's Divine Tarot. If this is your first time to the channel, welcome. Thank you so much for the love and support. If any part of this reading resonates with you, be sure that you thumbs up the video, all right? Also, leave me a comment in the comment section down below. I love to see where y'all tuning in from. I love to... Um, go back and forth with you guys in the comments all right so let me know where you're tuning in from if this message resonates with you or not also do not forget to subscribe of course it's okay once we hit 23k subscribers i'm going to be doing a giveaway to three lucky winners every time we hit a milestone here on our channel i want to be able to give back to you guys um as my appreciation for the love and support that you guys give me the donations um booking the readings all of that i appreciate it also hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when i upload your readings this is a general for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Or if you're dealing with an aqua, it could resonate with you. If you want to book a personal reading, check the description box down below. Take what resonates and leave the rest. All right, shout out to the Ghetto Nun. All right, for the tune-in deck. I love this deck. It's very powerful. Um, and she's so dope. All right. So I definitely fuck with her. Y'all definitely go and support the Ghetto Nun. Go get your tune-in deck. All right, so let's get into it. Let's see what important messages your spirit guides have for you, Aquarius. What's going on? With my beautiful Aquarius, Holy Spirit, God, and the Spirit Guides, ancestors of the Bible, light of protection. What's happening? All right. Oh, my goodness, Aquarius. Why? Why? I can, Tina? Oh, my goodness. Okay. So, I don't know. Some y'all could be dealing with somebody named Ike. Okay. Or, or Tina. All right. Or you could be in some type of situation like this. All right. Legality. Maybe you have escaped uh, a situation like this or you need to leave this if you're dealing with someone that is physically abusing you spiritually mentally emotionally abusing you you gotta get it out somebody's name could be mary but it says rhythm so i don't know this person could be a musician or you are um somebody abuses drugs and alcohol here all right uh fame so maybe this person has a big ego they want to be seen they want to be known or maybe this is you aquarius some of you guys have a destiny to like be in the spotlight and this person is trying to ruin um you know what I mean? Your destiny is the energy that I'm getting. Some of you guys are in a karmic relationship here. You have known each other for years. You've been dealing with this person for years. They can be obsessed with you, possessive. Yeah, some of you guys are definitely dealing with a karmic. Either you or your person here. I can tell you a situation is going on. My goodness. Wow, Drake. Okay. Okay, so we got love a boy, love a girl. We got a ladies man. Okay, here. Uh, So some of you guys could be either getting out of a karmic relationship or dealing with a karmic steal and there could be somebody new coming in okay oh papi okay so i don't know this person could have maybe they look like drake you know uh but night owl uh this person could work at night or you could be a night owl maybe you get a lot of work done at night somebody here stays up very very late uh but yeah champagne they stay up late drinking alcohol drugs okay so some of you guys can be dealing with a karmic and maybe they keep you up late to try to distract you from going to work and stuff like that um the finer things all right so i don't know somebody some of you guys are dealing with somebody here and maybe they come off to the public like this like they got it going on but really behind closed doors they're very abusive and uh they got some other stuff happening or aquarius y'all could have left uh, i can tina type of relationship or a karma situation and you're going to meet like whoever this is you know what i mean love a boy love a girl okay top five so this could be somebody that maybe you've dealt with before if not like this person is definitely going to be like in your top five of people that you've ever dealt with in your life okay somebody this person here could have had several men or several women because i'm hearing top five all right so you could have dealt with somebody and maybe you are like in their top five of favorite people they could be in your top five contact list or something it says thank me later all right so somebody here could have a friend male or female that uh this person may be interested in you but maybe you're in a karmic situation or whatever this person says thank me later so they could be coming to help you get out of like a karmic relationship all right or this is like the type of person that <laughs> you probably cry on their shoulder complaining about this karmic person the whole time they really want you i'm not really sure all right something about luxury so whoever this is they live a life of luxury okay they dress very well they could be a rapper they could do music i think drake is a libra all right so maybe y'all dealing with a libra could have libra in your chart all right what else is happening with my aquas yeah <clears throat> okay so look um this is outcast this is also like a duo you know you know um they were a group you know what i mean Andre 3000 and Big Boy. All right, so somebody here wants to team up with you. They want to work with you. 
All right. But like I said, some of y'all got a karmic that could be trying to block you from moving on with somebody here that looks better than them. They got way more going on than what they got going on. All right. But yeah, some of you guys may feel like an outcast. Sorry, Miss Jackson. Okay. So somebody here that you could have cut it off with this person here and maybe they feel outcasted by you prototype. They could have chose somebody else over you thinking the grass was green and they realized, no, they could have got with a karmic or something like that. I'm hearing elevators. So some of you guys are elevating to a higher status. All right. Or once you leave this karmic situation, like your spirit guides are going to elevate you to a higher status here. Uh, roses is here. So somebody here could be trying to buy you something nice, buy you roses. Somebody could be ordering flowers or getting you something nice. All right. Maybe you've never felt like this before, Aquarius, or you've never been treated like this before. It may be very alien to you with the aliens here. Uh, this person could believe in like, they could be into spirituality or they could be a conspiracy theorist. Maybe they believe in aliens and all that stuff. You know what I mean? Like you, this person could be different. You know, Andre 3000 was very different and weird and eccentric with his style. Okay. So much like an Aquarius, I don't know if he's an aqua or not, but I get aqua vibes from Andre 3000. I don't know why, but yeah. Okay. Can I get one more card for the aquas? So fresh and so clean clean so somebody definitely is a good dresser here either you or this person somebody is a stylist you could be a stylist or uh i don't know whoever this is coming into your life dresses very well or some of you guys could have been dealing with some, a karmic here that's very materialistic all right they want the fame they want the fortune they want the money but if they don't know how to treat you or they don't know how to treat people here or this is your person they could have chose somebody else over you to be in the spotlight and they are really like going downhill dealing with this karmic here. Wow. Look at you, Aquarius. All right, natural beauty. Male and female. You look good natural. All right, so yeah. Some of y'all could be running into somebody here and they could look terrible because they've been dealing with this karmic. And look at you. All right, having aged a bit. Okay, because you know who you are to your soul. Contemporary. So some of you guys look really, really good for your age, Aquarius. Okay, the lead. All right, so some of you guys are taking the lead in your life, taking back control of your power. Pride is here. Could be dealing with a Leo. Okay, this is no ordinary love. So some of you guys have some type of love situation coming in, somebody new. And this is not like your typical person. This is not like your ordinary type of person maybe they come off like a lover boy or a lover girl but this person is very different taboo all right so you may have a taboo type of relationship with this person um but yeah it says fountain of youth all right so yeah this person could be really young there could be an age difference but it says your love all right so yeah somebody here is like they really want your love they could miss your love here or this is you loving yourself some of you guys are, um, I'm hearing body language. So some of you guys are really good at studying people's body language. If you look at her body language on this uh, picture, Sade, y'all could be listening to Sade. You know, Sade kind of gets you in them vibes of, you know, make you just want to roll up or pour some wine and just lay back and relax. So some of you guys could have like that type of energy coming towards you or you could just be doing this with yourself. Um, but her body language, she's closed off. All right. Protecting her energy. So some of you guys are just doing self-love and you're protecting your energy here. You're like, no, I take the lead of my life, you know, and it may be taboo to a lot of people because maybe you used to being so outgoing and open and, you know what I mean? Fun, loving and just letting people, you know what I mean? Come and go out of your life. Not anymore. You're closing yourself up here. Yeah. Especially to a smooth operator. Smooth operator. Smooth operator. Okay, so yeah, somebody is sorry here. This smooth operator. All right, sorry, Miss Jackson. Somebody's last name could be Jackson. All right, this person could be like, you could have blocked this person, Aquarius, and they could be trying to contact your mom, your father, your friends to try to apologize, saying they want to buy your roses. Uh, some of y'all feel like the black sheep of the family, so you just closed off loving yourself. You know what I mean? So maybe you just live like a taboo type of lifestyle. Your spirituality, what you believe in, how you operate, you just, it's not like everybody else. All right? What else is here? Hey, I get one more card. Wow, back to the future. All right, so back to the future. So some of you guys are like going back to the basics, uh, going back to how you used to be. All right, so maybe some of you guys were open to somebody here and it turned karmic. Uh, this person could have really did a number on you or your person. Somebody here is going back to the basic, okay? Uh, fast forward, all right? So some of you guys, if you left a karmic situation or whatever, it's like your life has like been a blur since then. So much has happened, you know what I mean? 
It says back in time. Somebody wishes they can turn back the hands of time and make things right with you. It says great Scott. Okay. So some of you guys will be dealing with somebody. Their name could be Scott. Last name Scott. Um, doctor. Some of you guys could be dealing with a doctor. Maybe you need to go see the doctor. Could have been dealing with somebody and maybe you had to go to the doctor to get treated for something. Or you know what I mean? This person could have hurt you. Somebody here could be studying. Some of you guys are thinking about maybe going to school to get a doctorate. Um, it says experiment. I'm also hearing if you guys are going to the doctors for checkups and stuff like that, be mindful, okay? Because a lot of these doctors and stuff, they do experiments on people. We're going to see if this drug works. We're going to see if this treatment works. If we're going to see, okay, period. Some of y'all are realizing that. But this talks about divine timing here. So I definitely feel like things are working out in divine timing. Whatever it is that you are going through right now or that you went through, especially if it was something karmic, it was karmically meant to happen. All right, so some of you guys could be remembering maybe some things that happened um, and you're glad, you know what I'm saying, that you got out of this or, you know what I mean, you need to protect your energy more. Mech fly, all right? Some of y'all are really, really fly dressers or this person is um, science. Some of you guys love science. Maybe that's your favorite subject. Somebody could be a science teacher, all right? Something about scientific experiments. Some of you guys could be going over this with your kids or something. Watching like some old like scientific movies. Somebody could love sci-fi. Somebody could be in a sci-fi movie or something. Something about sci-fi. But yeah, back to the future. Some of you guys time travel, Aquarius. Some of you guys have a spiritual gift that you know how to time travel. All right? You astral project when you sleep. Okay? You can go back in the past. You can go travel towards the future. Like a lot of you guys have no idea. All right? Yeah, destiny. All right, some of you guys could be having visions or dreams about like your future, like you've seen yourself, like, you know what I mean, your future self. Some of you guys are like running into your future self, if that makes sense. It could be kind of out of this world, but those of you that know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. Some of you guys could be running into your future self, running into a man or a woman, and you're like, wow, that's me 10 years down the road. This person could be successful, super, uh, you know, well-known, stable, you know what I'm saying? Could be kind of nerdy but this says no roads so like i said some of you guys travel and you don't use roads you travel with your imagination okay or like i said you actually project or you time travel uh but yeah no roads is here some of you guys could have somebody that's trying to return into your life and it says no roads it may not go anywhere is what they're telling me so somebody here could be like wanting to do a rewind or wanting to do a redo uh whatever be mindful okay protect your energy here because this could be a lover boy a lover girl you know what I'm saying? Heat you up late at night to drag you right back into the same cycle. All right? At the bottom of the deck, look, NWA, niggas with attitudes. Okay? So whoever this is that you tell them, nah, I'm not trying to do a rewind. No, I'm not trying to go back to you. I'm not trying to go back down that road. Somebody going to get an attitude. Could be your friends, family. All right? <laughs> yeah, ruthless, rap music, parent discretion maybe your own parents yeah look fuck the police or this is like a bad boy or a bad girl somebody could be trying to drag you back into this lifestyle maybe you used to be in the streets and ruthless and reckless and you know so you guys have changed your life and you're like no i don't i don't dibble and dabble in that anymore and somebody here could get an attitude because of that aquarius but yeah stand your ground protect your energy i feel like that's why you look so good all right because you don't partake in that toxic shit no more you done left this situation or karmic energies and you're doing better for yourself um if you're currently dealing with this spirit is saying no more rewinds no more redos get out of this situation here all right or you're going to stay in this cycle okay so i love you aquarius if you resonate with any part of this reading thumbs up the video was absolutely free comment in the comment section down below um if you resonate with any part of this let me know where you're tuning in from and i will see you guys on the next reading bye